I have to ask you though, then because of COVID, the pandemic and everything that was going on, uh, what was it that motivated you to choose a HIPAA compliant healthcare virtual assistant? Were there any specific needs or goals that you were trying to address as a practice at that time? Yeah. So, uh, I mean, I think it was a challenging time to find staff due to the pandemic because many people were avoiding potential contact with others entirely. And, and what this basically created was a situation in which not even just PT clinics or medical clinics, but even larger retail companies and even fast food chains were, were offering well over the state minimum wage to find employees themselves. And so it was tough for us to compete in, in a market in which we were even looking for part-time help, let alone piecing together all the hours that we, we wanted administrative support for. So we felt that we needed to find a solution to that. And that was going to, again, maximize the patient onboarding experience for all the days and hours that we wanted coverage. And, and ideally at a price that was going to help us maintain the lower volume treatment methodology, you know, that, that we like to adhere to. And then obviously, you know, the HIPAA compliance thing is a major concern and, and, and something that, uh, you know, we take very seriously. And so for us, like BBC Medicals, VA services checked off um, all the boxes that we, we were looking for at that time. Yeah. How, how did you how did the relationship with BBC form? How, how did how did you even know to pick up the phone and have a conversation with our staff or team here to set this whole thing up? Uh, I think it was 